What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Raven C. Give you, giving you my thoughts on the defensive line upgrade. All right, so check this out. Okay, everybody know we got Calais. I'm still excited about that. I've been looking at this dude highlights like crazy. We got Derek Wolf. Derek Wolf, Denver Broncos. He said he wants to be a Raven as well in an interview. He said he's about to attempt, I think he said. He's about to try to attempt to do like a trade. But when he said when he's a free agent and the Ravens gave him a call, that was super exciting for him. So now we got Sack Daddy and we got Judon. So last year for as the pass rush. The entire team was, I believe it was ranked 21. That's not good. Out of 32 teams, 21. So, with just the addition of Calais Campbell and Derek Wolf, now Brandon Williams, even he said this in a recent interview, now he can play his position he loves to play, which is nose tackle. So... That's going to be very exciting. That's going to slow down the run. As the stats show, um, b between week week, uh, week three, Kansas City, they rushed on us 140 yards. So this day and age, you like, eh. It's, not, it's, it's kind of for the Ravens, I say that's not good for us, me, because I'm used to back in the day, we always used to didn't have 100 yards rushing when Ray, Ray Lewis was out there. But, you know, times has changed. Now we got a dynamic offense, and the defense is catching up. Now I believe we have a dynamic defense, and that's why I'm talking about that. I'm going to do another video about the offense, and majority of it is Lamar, my next video I'm going to do. Um, but that week four game against the Cleveland Browns, that was their Super Bowl when they beat us. Uh, it was 40 to 25. They smacked us good. But Chubb ran his tail off. I believe, I know they rushed 193 yards. The majority of it was him. Then, you know, we get some other games. We get a couple of rushers. Then we play San Francisco. But that was a, that was a game that was, uh, the weather was crazy. The weather was crazy on that one. So you just like, eh, I can get everybody going ground game. It was just like a ground game, back and forth on that game. They was going ground. We was going ground. Lamar was breaking ankles. Everybody was screaming. So, then I'm get to the main point is the Tennessee Titans. 217 yards rushing one game. 217 yards. That's time of possession. I know a lot of people are like, man, they abandoned the run. They abandoned the run, which I agree. I, I don't know why they didn't give the ball to Gus. But it's like the coaches went in panic mode because the defense couldn't stop the run. So they was like, we got to just try to hurry up and get some type of fast points. Kadari Henry was stiff on them people, stiffed on my boy Earl Thomas, made him look backwards and do a whole 360 type of stiff on. I never seen somebody get stiff on so bad that they, they completely turn in a circle. Like, what? You got stiffed on so bad, you went in a circle while running. <laughs> but this is a new defense. This is a new team now. So, and then in addition also, I'm going to get to the, um, the cornerbacks, the linebackers. I'm going to get to that in, in another video. But I believe we're going to go from having one of the worst run defense 
and sex. I haven't mentioned the sex yet, but that's about to come. We're going to have one of the worst. Because in Team Sex, I believe the rank was 21. So, with Brandon Williams playing nose tackle, with Calais, Derek Wolf, hopefully Sack Daddy coming to his own element. Then we got Judon. Everything is going to go. Every, everything is going to go pretty good. So, for that should slow down a run and also get that pressure. Get that pressure, get them sex. Because we know Wink, Wink have a lot of people coming for sex. Chuck, Earl, Marlon, my boy Peters, Tavon, Austin is back. I say it's Austin. <laughs> Tell you that news about Austin signing. Tavon Young is back. But it's gonna be uh it's gonna be sweet. So for us the sex, we have Judon last year. Now this is all last year. Judon had nine point five sex. Not bad when there wasn't anybody on the opposite side of him bringing that pressure as well. Because we know Suggs used to do that. Suggs is on another team. He's a little older now. As well. Brandon Williams, he had one sack last year. Now, Sack Daddy Ferguson, he had 2.5. Now, he wasn't starting um, at the beginning of the year, but he started to catch on a little bit at the end. And it, hopefully, this is a weird off season, so hopefully he get in his own element. Now, we have Calais Campbell. We know he's with the Jags. Pro Bowler. He had 6.5 sacks. With the Jags last year. Pro Bowler, well, like I said again, I still can't believe that's a steal. Like, EDC is that dude. Eric DaCosta is that dude. And also, Derek Wolf. He was with the Broncos last year. And he had 7 point. 7, I believe it's 7.5 or 7. No, it's 7. 7 sacks last year. So just and combined with just them, even though er, Calais Campbell and Derek Wolf was on a different team, we had those sacks up. That's twenty point twenty six point five sacks. Now the team was ranked twenty first last year. So my opinion, we should be top five. We we should be top five because that pressure. That Calais, you can't go. You can't go one on one with Calais and Brandon Williams. That's just no. You know, like be real. You know Calais. I believe he's like six eight. You know he get double team, and he still get that. He still got that. Then Brandon Williams is a monster in his own. Dude is big, strong, fast, good on his feet. You can't single that. So both of them beside each other. Then you got Derek Wolf. You can't. You just can't single that. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna be. Oh, it's gonna be so beautiful. It's gonna be so beautiful. But my my opinion, for as the defensive line, not the whole entire defense, for as the defensive line, for as the sacks, I believe we're gonna be in the top five. I believe Judon is gonna get the double digits. I believe Brandon William, he's obviously going to get way more than one. I see Sack Daddy. He had 2.5, came in the middle of the year. I give him six, seven sacks. Six, seven sacks. Yeah, six, seven sacks. For his second. Yeah, six, seven sacks. So y'all tell me what you think. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Thanks for the support, everybody stay safe.